Hi guys, I'm Stuke and this is my art channel. In this video we will choose the best for me, in my case the best animation software for 2D animation. And I will show you programs which used by professional animators in the industry and then we discuss uh, which one of the software I will use for my project and why. And let's start with uh, several most um, influential and most important uh, 2D software um, for cartoon and animation. The first one is Adobe Animation. Uh, this is very, very professional and popular program. Um, it's not free, you have to pay for it. But this was used, for instance, to animate Simpsons or to animate um, some Walt Disney projects. So if you uh, want to become a really professional artist and work in industry, so maybe um, this will be your choice. Uh, next one, which go in um, one pack sometimes with first one, uh, this is After Effects. So Adobe uh, products, they used uh, uh, together to create uh, 2D animation and uh, this one uh, helps to create more fun animation projects. So next, uh, 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 next one is Harmony Toon Boom. Uh, instead of previous two software, this one is more based um, on skeleton structures. So if um, Adobe animation is more or less where you draw uh, frame by frame or group frames with group frames, um, it's like more classical way to do cartoon or animation. But uh, this uh, program, this software, um, Toon Boom Harmony, uh, this is also um, one of the industry standard software and uh, uh, when you create animation, but by the way, a lot of Japanese animation uh, made with this one and manga and uh, other stuff. So um, this uh, type of animation based on skeletons, you make underlying skeleton structure and your character um, it, it pretends it has a bones and then you can move these bones um, to animate uh, this more easily. Um, then uh, next one is also very influential and one of industry standards for 2D animation. It's Open Tunes. It's open source animation software which is really <laughs> strong and cool and um, it also has and classical 2D features where you draw picture by picture and when you want to create some kind of uh, rig structures. So all that, uh, that these three uh, programs, they all use, sometimes they use together, you can use open tunes and 2D animate and harmony and mix them on together because each one has different features. So next, let's move to um, maybe less popular, a little bit less popular um, and um, but very interesting projects. Here is a TV paint. It is for years <laughs> um, on the um, the software market, a software field and if you can see by the website, website looks really old-fashioned but this software um, is really powerful and you can make uh, and it's specifically made for 2D animation and uh, there is plenty of professional animators who, who use this one. Next one uh, called Clip Studio Paint and this uh, uh, one became popular I guess because uh, uh, you can use it on um, laptops and uh, uh, digital uh, tablets and whatever so uh, 
it more or less combined with modern technology and uh, mobile phones and something like this. Procre uh, procreate like uh, um, mobile phones and uh, tablet PC. You, you have uh, to buy it, so it's not free. Um, but it's still, um, as I uh, see, really powerful. Next one to choose is um, Autodesk 3D Max. Um, it's uh, this program 3D Max is very popular among 3D animators and among scientists. So if you make uh, scientific projects or if you make any kind of architecture or 3D, of 3D animation, um, this one, this 3D Max by Autodesk is very good choice. Mm, but also, uh, in combined with 3D animation, they have uh, possibility to make 2D animation. This program is not specifically made for 2D, it's more like, it's more 3D one, but 2D uh, features is quite strong as animators uh, uh, evaluate this. And also we have um, one of, I think, Maybe uh, not that popular projects among professional animators, but the project will, which rising right now and which has a lot of support and um, which develop very um, innovative features in case of 2D animation. This is Blender. Uh, Blender, it's also very complex uh, software. It's not made specifically for 3D or for 2D. It's very, very complex one. It uh, looks like mm, it, close to uh, 3D Max and it's a little bit close maybe to Harmony. Um, something in between because it has very strong um, 3D uh, model, models inside and it helps you to create animated pictures which has like bone-like structures and you can move them and also you can use um, in latest release they implemented um, their innovation in case of 2d animation and there is plenty of artists who say that um, this blender uh, by the way it's free it's open source i guess i think yes it's open source and it's free it's total free, you do not have to pay for anything in Blender. So this is crazy because it's uh, for the last years, for the last five years, it became one of the strongest software, not only in the 3D world, but, but uh, with the last um, updates, um, they go inside 2D animation and they have very big ambitions. And some artists, some professional 2D artists say that in a very, very uh, uh, close future, this blender can um, may become uh, industry st standard for professional animation, some professional animation studios. Uh, and why is this so? Because blender now combine um, 2D, professional 2D, and professional 3D. There is not many, unless Harmony maybe, there is not many, so many programs which um, developed, uh, which develop at the same time 2D and 3D dimensions. And uh, what to choose? If you are just starting and you want to try um, 2D animation for yourself, what to choose? I think the answer is really easy you have to choose something free there is some free there are some free software and you have to start with free one because why you would pay so so much money if you just don't know would you become animator or not so just try something uh, something easy and cheap um, for me i started with autodesk uh, sketchbook this is amazing program for drawing. They have uh, uh, very beginning anim 2D animation features and I made my first 2D animation in Autodesk Sketchbook previously and my previous video, uh, short video was just with my animation. And now I would like to move uh, for Blender. This is my choice and why this is my choice. 
easy because again it's free uh, you don't have, you don't have to pay for it and it is crazy powerful crazy updated you have a lot of updates um, and the big group of people work on this project they're very passionate and recently they implement 2d very strong model um, they started with 2d i guess just in 2018 that there was first uh, implementation in this program and now three years later they uh, showed something very interesting and i would like to try it for free <laughs> this is important so if we will go to blender so this is blender i uh, like blender a lot just in just in general like a software because it is crazy powerful and um, I'm not a professional at all in this program, but I'm just, uh, I see so many possibilities. So I'm just uh, inspired by this and I want to dig inside. And where you can find animation, you come to Blender, you put animation uh, here uh, and you can make plus and you will see 2D animation. This is something crazy. Uh, powerful and crazy new you can try it and in this to the animation there is um, some new features we will discuss it maybe in the future when I get used to it and when I will be uh, more professional to talk about this so guys uh, now please tell me in the comments um, which software do you use if you are in case uh, you are a 2d animator or have some knowledge about this and please tell me um, what will be your choice. Will you try Blender? Maybe uh, will you prefer Harmony or OpenTones or any other software? See you in, in my next video. Do not forget to subscribe to Stuki Art channel. Bye!